Hello and welcome to another episode of Short and Sweet TV. We'll be looking at Illustrator in this episode and how you can create dotted lines. So to start off with, we'll grab our line segment tool. We'll just come across to the toolbar and select that one. And starting from left to right, I'm just going to click and drag. Now, if I hold the shift key down, it will make sure that this line, it will constrain it to being a perfectly horizontal line. You can see without holding shift, I can drop it anywhere. But if I hold shift down, it'll make it perfectly horizontal. Um, I want to change the stroke. So I'm going to come across and click on the stroke panel to open it up. Um, if you can't see it over there on the right hand side, you can always get to it from the window menu and then scrolling down to stroke. Okay, by default, it doesn't have any of the options open. So I need to click on this little drop down menu here to show all options. And it's in here that we can determine um, what sort of line we have, whether we want it to be dashed or dotted. So to create a dotted line, what I need to do is choose this cap end here, the round cap, that second one. And I can drop down here where it's got dash lines. You want to make sure that is ticked and mine currently is ticked. Now for a dot, the dash needs to be set to zero. Then we've got the gap, which is just the space between each of the dots or the dashes. So I'm going to um, put uh, five points between each. And if I just click anywhere outside there, and as you can see, it's applied the dots. I can increase the size of the dots by coming up to the weight that large. There we go, four points. And I can increase the distance between them by increasing those points there. Might give them a different color as well. So there you have it. To create a dash line, I'll just duplicate this line here to demonstrate that. So for a dash, I can just give them a little bit of width. So if I make them four points um, in width, we've now got a dash and if I wanted to reduce the weight there. There you have it, we've got a dash line and a dotted line through using our stroke panel in Illustrator. So you've hopefully found this episode helpful and I look forward to seeing you in the next Short and Sweet TV episode.